Good afternoon, my name's Robert Jones and I'm head teacher at Hayden School and a very warm welcome to our open evening. Obviously this year the arrangements for open evening are very different. Normally you'd have the opportunity to come to the school, have a look round, um, visit all of our wonderful facilities and meet the staff and students. Because of coronavirus that is not possible. So this short film is going to provide you with the reasons why I think Hayden School is the best choice for your child. Personally, I've worked for a long time at Hayden School. This is my 22nd year at the school and my ninth as head teacher. And it excites me to welcome you to Hayden School. There will be so many opportunities for your child. The vision for our school is achieving individual excellence in a caring community. We want all of our students and members of staff to realise this vision. I'm going to start by talking about individual excellence and more specifically, academic excellence. As a parent myself, I understand the importance of examination results. It is a vital key to your child's future. I will start initially with our Year 13 examination um, results this summer. Many of our Year 13 students have been at Hayden School for seven years and for me the greatest success is to see their outcomes at the end of that period of study. This year, in 2020, our A-level results were quite superb. 58% of our A-level grades were graded A star, A and B, the highest A-level grades and those grades required to get into Russell Group Universities. 82% of our A-level grades were graded A to C. There were some fantastic individual performances. Three of our students achieved four A star or A grades at A-level. And 31 students achieved three or more A star and A grades, which is quite a phenomenal achievement. Following this summer's examination results, 153 of our Year 13 students have um, confirmed places at university. One quarter of these are going to the most difficult universities to get into, known as the Russell Group Universities. In each year, over the last five years, we've sent approximately 150 students to university, with about 50 going to Russell Group Universities every year. Last year, in 2019, I was delighted to be informed that one quarter of all students who went to Russell Group Universities in the London Borough of Hillingdon attended this school. Many of our students go straight into employment after they finish their A-level studies. Last year, 30 Hayden School students found employment on high-level apprenticeships at such places as Warner Brothers Studios, British Airways, a fast-track civil engineering programme through the Department of Justice, and others in accountancy and finance, the Royal Mail, Network Rail and Transport for London. At GCSE, again, the students were awarded grades based on their centre assess grades, considering the grade that the youngsters were most likely to get in their GCSEs. At Hayden School, we had over 519 grades 9 and 8, which are the highest grades that a student can achieve in their GCSEs. That's 19% of the cohort. In those results, there were some superb individual performances. 37 Hayden School students got five or more of the highest grades at grades 9 and 8, which is a truly phenomenal achievement. Hayden School has been judged as an outstanding school by Ofsted since June 2007, maintaining this grade through an HMI inspection in May 2015, which particularly focused on the performance of our disadvantaged students. Ofsted reviews the performance of the school on an annual basis and has deemed it unnecessary to undertake a another full inspection. Hayden School is also in the Good Schools Guide which describes the school, a friendly comprehensive that really does cater for all. So what does it mean to be an outstanding school for over 13 years? It is quite an achievement to maintain this standard for such a long period of time. I will highlight what it means um, and I'm going to start by looking at the quality of teaching. 
The quality of teaching is obviously vital for a school to remain outstanding for so long. As part of the process to maintain high quality teaching, we regularly undertake reviews of different areas of the school. We use consultants, Ofsted inspectors and senior staff from other local schools. And these reviews provide some fantastic real positives about learning in the school, but also areas for improvement. We encourage all of our students to develop the following key values, kindness, community, respect, excellence and perseverance. These are values that will be important for students as they move through life. Staff reward the students by giving them good news notes. One really important and successful feature of the school is the school's relationship charter. I'm now going to hand over to Mrs Whitehead, who's the deputy head teacher, who's going to explain how this works. Hello, my name is Caroline Whitehead and I'm the deputy head at Hayden School. One of the things that makes me very proud of Hayden School is our caring ethos. You will have seen our vision for our school is achieving individual excellence in a caring community. And it's the caring community that I want to talk to you about. As a parent, I know that one of the most important things about school is the happiness of a child. A happy child with positive relationships at school is a child that will thrive. Visitors to Hayden often comment on the very positive relationships they see between staff and students. And we develop these relationships in a really positive, well-ordered school environment that's underpinned by something we call our relationship charter. And a key part of this charter is the power of praise. We know that the power of praise and recognition is a key tool to motivate and encourage students. And we pay particular attention to each student's personal behaviour and the attitude they have towards their work. We all like to know when we're doing well and staff will tell students when their work or their behaviour is good. We have a great praise and recognition system to recognise when students have gone over and above in terms of their conduct. Every term students will attend celebratory events to recognise their continued outstanding behaviour, their effort and their progress in their studies. You will also have live information on how well your child is doing in school through an app which shows not only their attendance but also their behaviour and their achievement which will enable you to form a really good partnership with us in praising your child um, for the good work they're doing in school. In school there'll be um, certificates, good news notes, head teacher's commendations and even occasionally a, head, a hot chocolate with the head teacher himself. When things don't go right, it's important to know how we support students. Sometimes children will get things wrong and it's an important part of growing up and learning about relationships. So to support students when this happens, we take a restorative approach to rebuild relationships. These restorative meetings help to restore and rebuild relationships between staff and students and it allows relationships to be reset and built upon without feeling punitive for a child. And in order to strengthen relationships, all our staff commit to fresh starts every lesson and consistent routines and calm behaviour. We know that relationships are vital in the success of a child, but never more so than now during the pandemic to make sure students feel safe and happy at school. And the relationships with key adults at school is important Students join a tutor group with a form tutor and a year leader in year seven who will stay with them throughout their time at Hayden so that we can get to know students really, really well. We look forward to getting to know your child and seeing them thrive within our caring school community. As you are aware, all schools have recently gone, down, gone through a lockdown period and our school tr community truly came together at this time. In addition to the work that was set by teachers, 
Students and in many cases their parents embraced our weekly Hayden at home challenges. These challenges varied from building dens, weekly cooking challenges to designing recycled products. We received hundreds of entries each week and our year, lead, year leaders were blown away by the ingenuity and sense of togetherness that was fostered. Hayden is a very caring school and students need support at various stages of their school career and I'm proud of the different types of support that we are able to offer. We have an excellent learning support department we have a link department which offers support to students who are going through a tough time either in school or at home. We have two school counsellors who are there to support our students and staff. We also have a welfare assistant who supports the youngsters when they feel unwell. There is also an independent careers advisor who works at the school um, offering the youngsters guidance on their next steps. Academic success is only one part of school. It is vital that students develop the knowledge and skills to do well and succeed in external qualifications as these are the currency to progress onto the next stage of their lives, be it at university, college or the world of work. But it's also really important that they develop character. By character I mean their ability to work effectively under pressure, to have the confidence to take on new challenges and work effectively as a team member, to understand that failure is part of the learning process and that, will, and that they will be challenged by staff. It is vital that they are given opportunities to lead and to develop their leadership skills. We have developed an excellent extracurricular and trips programme to help develop character. Now unfortunately at the moment all of the things that I'm going to describe are on hold, but I'm really hoping by the time you start at Hayden School, or by the time your children start at Hayden School in September 21, we're going to be back to normal. We offer a very large number of international trips, um, local trips, residential trips. So last year, some of the highlights were our Duke of Edinburgh Gold students went to Croatia for a week. On that programme they have to take, uh, take part in an independent trek. We run a Year 9 water sports trip to the south of France. Every two years our students, um, our senior students participate in a World Challenge or Far Frontiers trip and they have to raise money to pay for the trip and then they go to different parts of the world and they undertake some, some walking or trekking in the region. They also volunteer to support with some community work. Over the last few years our students have gone to Nepal, to Zambia and Botswana, to Uganda, um, to Peru. Um, it's a really, really popular trip and it's quite life-changing actually for the young people that take part. Our scientists go to CERN, our ski trip goes to Switzerland, um, in previous years they've been to Italy, they've been to France and they've been to the States. We have a year 7 camp that goes to Snowdonia, we also have a year 8 camp that goes down to the New Forest. We've also run um, an Italian exchange for those students studying um, Italian. We've had a Christmas markets trip that's regularly gone to the Christmas markets in Cologne. We've also run um, a classics trip to Pompeii. So our performing arts department is another extremely strong area of the school that offers the, the youngsters um, great opportunities in drama and also in music. We host an annual um, Hayden's Got Talent competition which is a real delight to to be in the audience at and I have been a judge in the past. We also have um, a key stage three performance every year and the, the whole school performance. We also have a partnership with some other schools in the London Borough of Hillingdon and we've done some great work which has seen Hayden School students perform on stage at the Royal Shakespeare Company in Warwick and also on stage at the Old Vic. Another area of great strength from an extracurricular point of view is our PE department. The school is extremely successful and we often win the Hillingdon competitions. We offer a wide range of sports including football, cricket, rugby. 
There's a fantastic trampolining club, gymnastics after school. If you're into sport, there's a huge variety of options available to you. Now, one of the great strengths of sending your child to Hayden School, one of the real areas of success is the Duke of Edinburgh programme. Now, just to give you a little bit of um, an insight into this programme, students can start um, taking the programme when they're in, in year nine. And the youngsters have to succeed in four different areas to get the award. One is volunteering in the community. One is undertaking a residential activity. One is undertaking a, an expedition. And the youngsters also have to work at developing a skill. Now, right at the end of last term, I was sent a publication from Duke of Edinburgh, London, which showed the number of awards that all schools had achieved across the whole of Greater London. And Hayden School actually was the fifth in the whole of all of the different London boroughs in the number of students who had completed one of the three programmes which are known as Bronze, Silver and Gold. 186 students up until the end of March last year from Hayden School had successfully um, passed their Duke of Edinburgh award. So it's a real success for the school. Last year I was lucky enough to be invited to the gardens at Buckingham Palace as a guest of honour to see seven of our former students receive their Duke of Edinburgh Gold Award from Prince Edward. Like their parents I felt extremely proud um, of the Hayden School students. Hayden School is a large school having just under 1900 students. I know that some of our prospective parents worry about the transition, the transition from primary to a large secondary school. As a large school, we are able to offer an extremely broad range of GCSE and A-level options. Indeed, the students have 35 GCSEs to choose from, and when they get into the sixth form, there are 34 A-level courses and BTEC national courses. I sincerely believe that students succeed when they are on the courses that they want to do, and at Hayden School they will have a far greater range of, of courses to study than at any other school from doing triple science to doing construction from Latin to PE. There really is a very very broad range of subjects. One of the benefits of being a large school is I can recruit highly specialised staff. I'm able to employ specialist teachers, many of whom are, are GCSE and A-level examiners themselves to teach the children. This means they have direct experience of setting and marking the courses being taught. We currently have 117 teachers working in this school. We also have very many specialist support staff who provide excellent expertise to support the learning of the youngsters. On a normal open evening, following my presentation, you'd have an opportunity to have a look round our site, but we've spent a lot of money making significant improvements to, to our facilities to ensure that the students have great facilities in which to learn. So our music and drama facilities opened in September 2014 at the cost of £2 million. In January 2015 we opened a new activity centre at the cost of £2.5 million. We have a state-of-the-art building for art, design and technology. We've also recently refurbished our sixth form facilities. They have a fantastic common room with its own cafe that's open to them all day. Through a partnership with a local cricket club, we now have cricket nets in one of our three sports halls. Um, they've been a recent addition. We've also recently developed an open learning centre that allows over 100 students to be taught together. There are over 1,000 computers in the school and all of the classrooms are equipped with interactive whiteboards to enable teachers to de deliver lessons of the highest quality. For your child to succeed at school, it is important that we develop an effective partnership with you. Hopefully there will be lots of opportunities for, for us to celebrate the achievements of your child during his or her time at Hayden School. Thank you very much for taking the time to, to watch our presentation. I do hope it's given you an invaluable insight to life at Hayden School. To the Year 6 students, I know you'll be back at school and I hope you're enjoying yourself in your bubble. I wish you every success this year and I do hope that you choose Hayden School. 
I look forward to meeting you in the future. We are. We are.